In the NFC, Shannon not only picked the Vikings to win the division over Wayne's Packers, but he also picked Minnesota to go all the way to the <laughs> NFC Championship game. Not too long after that, Wayne texted Skip telling Shannon to lay off that cognac. All right, Wayne, it's one thing to say it over text. Now it's your turn to tell Shannon in mm. person how wrong you think he is. <laughs> For real, you know. <laughs> I was just, I was just, I couldn't believe you. I, I know you, but I know you love first cousin. Yeah, yeah. I know you love first cousin. I know you stand behind the people that you rock with. But, uh, yeah, you had to be on some of that report here. Had to. <laughs> Look, can I ask you a question? Do you trust Alan Lazard, who's possibly injured, might not even play, Sammy Watkins, Randall Cobb, or Justin Jefferson and Adam Thielen? Of course, I'm going to I'm going to go with my squad. I'm going to go with my squad. But Justin, Justin is a dog. Justin is a dog. He come from LSU. He a dog. Yeah. But well, my squad. Yes, I. It, rather Allen, rather Allen is out there or not. I definitely trust Allen. Dalvin Cook, yeah. Z Darius Smith. Yeah, they gone. Danelle Hunter. Yeah. Pat P. Mm-hmm. <sighs> Yeah, yeah, I'm seeing. I'm, I'm wait, wait, big pride. Y'all pride what wait, up there. Wait, 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 wait a second. You you keep. Ignoring the quarterback for the purple team. That's that's why I, I'm telling you. You know, there, there's something about when he plays Green Bay, he brings out his best effort. Now you watch. Now he gonna light him up. You remember last year what he did to him, right? Mm -hmm. You remember that? I remember. Okay. <laughs> but that's when he was riding that wave. He on it? No, nah, that wave. That time Ben came in. And, and now he's got the uh, protege of Sean McVay, uh, McVay mm -hmm. protege. Mm -hmm. Now you know these hey, the McVay proteges. Everybody trying to get him. I'm the same Sean McVay lost. That's, yeah, he lost. You know, that, 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 that Super Bowl winning coach though. He's Super Bowl. Yeah, Super Bowl. you're right. You're yeah. right. You're right. Boy wonder. Yeah. Hey, okay, you keep on talking. Now we got the opportunity. You want to put some dew on it? You know, Skip don't like when he ran ran on that. Uh, yeah, you saw when he ran right there. Yeah, he did yeah. another Tom yeah. Brady. Oh, Sean <laughs> McVay ran down the <laughs> He liked that. <laughs> All-time grandstand. They went all the time hot dog move. I, no coach in the history of coaching has ever done that before. <laughs> Run all the way up the tunnel yeah. after D-Jack. Yeah. We got him. <laughs> we got him. We got him. We got him. Skip, ain't nothing like when you call up. Wait, wait, you know what? Like, when you call him, like, you go in there, you writing it. You know you writing a banger. Yeah. You wait, when you put that thing, you put that thing in the studio. I'm like, ooh. That's what he did. He's exactly. Like, he dialed that play up. By the way, McVay after the game last night, I'm falling on my sword. It's my fault. I, I watched the whole thing after the My fault. I, I got to coach better. I got to coach. You want to coach better. He just got a, like a five-year extension it's yesterday yeah. morning. Yeah. Seriously. Yeah. He's good to go, you know? Like, <laughs> That's I'm, why I'm, I'm good to go with Cousins. Okay. So Are does, you it, really? does anybody want to put anything okay. on? Somebody over here might just want to put a whole lot on it because when you most expect it from Kirk Cousins, you get it right between the eyes. I, I know him. I have seen him fold Thanks. under pressure, under Dallas Washington pressure, because Dak Prescott owned Kirk Cousins. Dak, who you think is a middle of the pack he Dak. Is. Middle he of is. the pack he Dak. Is. He, is. He, is. he owned Kirk Cousins when he was in Washington. Dak Prescott is four and one against Kirk Cousins. Kirk Cousins against the Dallas Cowboys is two and eight. And I'm gonna remind you, my Cowboys went up there two years ago with Andy Dalton at quarterback and beat them in their building. Last year, my Cowboys went up to Minneapolis, to Minnesota, yeah. with our backup quarterback, Cooper Rush, in a big uh -huh. Sunday night game, I believe it was. Sunday, yeah, it was Sunday night. And Cooper Rush beat Kirk Cousins. That, that's how, how little you can trust Kirk yeah. Cousins. Boy, well, how much and should you I... picked him to get to the <clears throat> NFC Championship since, since game. Since we're talking about trust, how much should I trust Aaron Rodgers? <laughs> Well, on the field in the regular season, a lot. A lot. Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Are we talking about the back-to-back -back MVPs, <laughs> yeah. that guy? Oh, yeah, yeah, the back-to-back. -back. So, uh, also the back-to-back -back guy that lost back-to-back -back games in the playoffs. <laughs> mm. That guy. Yeah, that guy. And is this a playoff game? No. Sunday? No. First Cousins going to get him. <laughs> you did you see it last year? How First Cousins outdoed him last year, Skip? Mm. No. He did that. Mm. You can't trust him. And you have put all your faith in him, and you're about to put Three more cases of diet do. I believe in Jefferson. I got three on Aaron oh, Rodgers on Sunday. Serious. You gave me the points. 
No, what points? They took uh, your uh, three, right? It's yeah, a point three. and a half. Okay, give me that. Point a point and, and, half. and a half. You don't get anything. You got your cousins. Them. I don't want them. <laughs> I don't want no points. Good. I you thought about giving. Me. I was so confident with uh, nephew. I thought about giving him points. Mm. <laughs> I thought about giving you points. Mm. But since you didn't ask for them, I'm gonna you're say feeling, okay, straight up. You hey, feeling too regular good? Regular season though. opener. Aaron Rodgers will put yeah, on the show. Yeah, you feeling too good? Ain't no pressure. You forgot the. You you forgot. You forgot our coach, right? You forgot his record. Mm. Oh, y'all mean that he's good? But that pre- but I don't know what happens when it comes down to me, really me making them a really good calls. Mm. He don't be making them. Mm. I'm going with McConnell. I mean, look at y'all receivers. Alan Lazard yeah. might not play. Sammy Watkins. <laughs> Randall Cobb. Sammy's still a mm. dog, no? Mm. How about Sky with two Ys? You know that guy? Chris, uh, uh, Christian Watson mm. and Romeo. Mm-hmm. Romeo Dobbs. Yeah. Mm. Mm. The rookie. Romeo, Romeo. Mm. I can't do this. <laughs> I can't. Hold on. Didn't Aaron Rodgers call him out in training camp? Didn't he call out Dobbs in training camp? camp. Dude, what oh. the fuck that? That's why he did it. It's training camp. So he could be ready for moments Justin like Jefferson. This. Justin Jefferson going for a bill. Who, who told me that Aaron Rodgers is the transcendent thrower of the football, the greatest thrower of the football ever he since is. Shannon Sharp, who happens to be in the Pro Football Hall but of Fame? But them, them, them first games normally look, look tough on him. Yeah. The first game. Remember last year, that first mm-hmm. game in New Orleans? Remember that? You remember that I in Jacksonville? I do. Yeah, I do. Shannon. What we did after you, that, You though, just huh? bet on the wrong guy. I ain't bet better. after that, huh? No. Y'all, y'all went on a little tear. Y'all went on a little tear. But, you know, hey, he, he might take off to uh, uh, Costa Rica and get them, them, mm. one of them, one of them old drinks again. <laughs> you know, where he spawned out on the beach. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what? I, went, I mean, there ain't no telling. I, I don't know what's going on. He said, that's the best he ever been. He said, oh, you know, he got to get to that place. Mm. Just saying. <laughs> There's one man in sports you do not bet against, and that guy wears number 12 for Tampa Bay. There's one guy in sports you always bet against when the chips get pushed to the middle of the table, and that is the guy you just bet on. I'm going with Kim Folk, Kirk. Yeah. Okay. Kim Folk. He, he, he say we ain't no kids or kid folk. Mm-hmm. We just a relative, you know. Mm-hmm. We done hung around each other so long. You know, you know how we do it. We hang around someone so, so long. So long. We, we call them cuz. That's, mm-hmm. that's my brother. That's my. And, that's they, my... and then you know what happened when they get real, real, they gone. <laughs> mm-hmm. So I will okay. bet you three cases three. on Sunday's game. I got Aaron Rodgers straight up, and I will bet you ten more cases that Kirk Cousins doesn't play in the NFC Championship game. No, this year. no, ten well, no, more no, cases. no. We already got. We got ten. We got ten on Sunday on Cleveland and, yep. and Panthers. Mm-hmm. We got three. What we got on the Cowboys? Nothing. You... I told you I'm what? not betting on it. I don't bet against Brady. Yeah, but you picked Dallas. the Cowboys. I'm ride or die. And they're they're my team. Against, you well, what do you, what do you expect me to do? You know I that. expect you to bet. Huh? I'm not going to bet any do on it. Well, I'm not going to jinx. That's okay. Yeah. <laughs> Brady unjinxable. Huh? <laughs> that's what he you tell me about your Cowboys. Yep. The Cowboys are unjinxable this year. Okay. You told me you want to go jinx. They got to go. They okay, I'll, I'll do a 10-case bet. I'll, I'll do 10 cases on Kirk doesn't make it to the NFC Championship game, and I'll do 10 on Brady does make it to the no, NFC Championship game. No, no. Why no. not? Because I want this game. There are 16 games. I want this one. I want you to put up the courage of your conviction. Go out on the limb like you tell me. I got one, too. What you want? You, let's bet I got a bottle of Bumboo, you bet me a bottle of Poitier. For the game Sunday? Yes. Duh. I like that. <laughs> I hate to do you. I, see, I don't even really like to do you like, because I you good people. I, like, you, well, I, I don't want to do that. I, I can't do that. I, that's why I didn't pro, propose no bet to you. Mm. But him, I be trying to rick him call the cold. <laughs> but I ain't want to. But you went for it. I need that. This man made I one mistake that. on this show once upon a time before the NFC Championship game at Green Bay. We had you on the show, and you you proposed the bet. You bet me one case of Diet Mountain Dew that Aaron Rodgers would beat Tom Brady, and I said, that's a mistake. And to his credit, he actually had Amazon send me a case. I got a case. They knocked on my door and put it down on the floor. I got a real case. Un- unlike somebody sitting across from me Man, I brought you owns a me 70. I brought you a pallet of 70 cases of do. <laughs> yeah, well, you're, you're back again. You're back in the hole. And you're about to be in a hole you can't swim out of. That's all right. I'm going to be up 13. Let's see, 13. We got some other bets, too. To go. You're going to be so mad. Oh, I can't believe After you picked Kirk. After this season? Kirk. 
Uh, One of y'all is going to have to build a case for all of that yeah, Mountain yeah. Dew that you'll be giving each other. <laughs> Wayne, awesome stuff. We're going to get you to hang around for another segment. We need more of you in our lives. We're going to debate if this season will be a bounce-back year for LeBron yeah. and the Lakers. Oh, here we go. That's next on Undisputed. Of course. Mm.